fingers. I'm used to this kind of stuff, okay? Use a spoon. Hello, my gorgeous peeps in my universal world of peeps. Today, you're going to love this video because guess what? Guess where I'm going? I'm going back. I'm going back. I'm going back into a restaurant. Oh, yeah, Mama Cherry's going to be running the pass. We are doing Soul in a Bowl at Indigo. It's a lovely seafood kind of special restaurant and worthy by the sea. And they wanted me, the mama, to come and do a special evening. So I want you all to sit back and watch. So what you're going to see first is how we put it together in the kitchen. A little bit of prep. And then you're going to see me speak to the people <laughs> as I do my royal speak to speech. The like you're some dignitary. I am. I, listen, I was invited. And you're guess what? Speak to the people. Even more so, I got paid. Too right. Oh, well, I'm getting paid. I've invoiced them. I ain't got paid yet. And then you're going to see the fabulous food. So sit back and enjoy. Soul in the bowl now. Over now. Chef Luca there. He is zesty. Say hello. Hello, guys. And look at this. Here we go. Say hello. Hiya. Okay, we're making key lime pie. Y'all, you can see that. You can see them eggs. They're super yellow. That's because they use a free range. Y'all know me. I use basic. <laughs> <laughs> you can tell the difference. Okay, so I am in a big kitchen here at Indigo restaurant. I will take you out and show you what it looks like in a minute here in the heart of Worthing. But I'm going to put my camera down because I need to get back in the kitchen and do some work. Look at here. Look at here. In the oven we have our peach cobbler cooking. We're just about to make up some buttermilk but let me just show you the uh, key lime pies we've done. Let's go in here. Where are they? Uh, where'd they go? Ah, here we go. Two key lime pies cooling down. That's it. Making up our own buttermilk. Perfect. Now this buttermilk is going to be used for our cornbread as well as our um, chicken, wings. Chicken, chicken wings. Get them marinated. Yes, it's me. I'm here. I'm not just doing a voiceover. You got me? Okay. Let's go back. Here we go. So, okay, to that we want to add, I want you to just add some vinegar. Pour and I'll tell you when to stop. Lemon juice goes in. We're there. That's it. Buttermilk. Now we can do it for our scones, our own Yeah, you can. I'm telling you. It's so easy. Here we go. So here we go. Pour it in. Perfect. Now mix that in. And what it is, is the acid. That right. So that's perfect. So we're there. So that's going to be for our cornbread, which is plenty. And this is going to be poured over top of our wings. So if we bring the wings. Okay, let's see here. Okay, so first thing first, um, can you get that Cajun seasoning that I had that I bought you? Look at them there wings. Okay, so and can you get some cracked black pepper and some salt? Yep. And then let's just get that mixed up. Just put some sprinkle across the top. That's it. And now the same with some salt. And now we just want to get all of that just mixed in together so that we get those seasonings. Perfect. Oh, it Perfect. If only you had smell o vision, you could smell I, that's this. That's what I'm telling people all the time. <laughs> you need smell o vision. Okay, so now let's just get this buttermilk. That's good. Now just pour that buttermilk over the top. All of it? All of it. Perfect. So now 
We're just going to give that another mix. So what is it? The acid in there helps it's, tenderize them? It helps right, yeah? tenderize them, yeah. The acid in that will tenderize your chicken so it just falls off the bone. It also, what it does, it does, it's kind of like a chemical cooking. So it's, it's breaking that meat down. Oh. And there. Mmm! Yummy, yummy, yummy. Amazing. Amazing. So now that's it. So now we will just leave this to marinate overnight. And then tomorrow, um, we're going to, first thing what we're going to do tomorrow when I get here, is we're going to take out the portion that we need for lunch. Yeah. And we're just going to add some flour to that first. So it goes gloopy. Uh -huh. yeah. uh -huh. And then we leave that to sit. And then just prior to service, we re-flour it, drop it down, and then you get that extra crunch. Oh, That's how you get the crunch. You get that double batter on it. That's what I'm waiting for. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. So we are now moving on to cornbread. It's tea time for the mama. So I'm gonna, um, y'all know what it means. You've already seen eggs cracking, so you don't need to see all the eggs cracking. We're gonna come back when this is made, because I'm gonna make myself a cup of tea. Couple of good handfuls? Yep, put a handful in. Okay, we have in there some celery. We're adding some onion. A bit more? Yeah, a bit more. Perfect. And now we're going to put some peppers, some mixed peppers. And what we're doing is we're trying to go for, we're making a paste of our trinity of soul. The basis of our soul food, which is celery, onions, and peppers. And we're gonna, I'm going to be adding my Cajun seasoning to this. And then this is all going to go, so that's good. Now go for some other colors, because I'm a colorful person. <laughs> Not much is, but... Uh, no, not much. <laughs> not much. Okay, and now let's just blend this up and see if we can make ourselves a lovely soul food paste. Oh, it's looking good already. And this is what we're going to use to season our rotisserie chickens. I've just had a taste and it needs some fresh lemon juice. And I think this is going to make a lovely. Oh, it's going to taste good. Need to get that to go, and it's a lovely color. It's going to look good when it roasts. Right so we just get that into something, and then we're ready to rock and roll. All right, coleslaw on the go. Show them how to do it. And over here we have some fabulous pineapple salsa being made. Yes. Okay, back in the kitchen. Got a big pot of succotash on. You see that? Suffering succotash. We's cooking. Cooking, cooking. Oh, yeah. Prepping the chicken for the jambalaya. The chorizo has just gone into the rationale. And we're just getting all of our cheeses ready for our cheese sauce. For our macaroni and cheese. It does. Okay, so we're whipping up the macaroni and cheese. We've just made our cheese sauce. It's got blue, brie, mozzarella, cheddar, good good and booger. It's gonna be good. Now we're gonna get it loaded up. One. Back in the kitchen. So jambalaya is cooking. We're getting ready for service. We have, let's open these, let those rest, look at there, ribs, oh look at those delicious chickens, oh my giga mugga. Mama Cherry's Cajun Roasted Spit Roast Chicken coming at ya! Woo! Dang it gone! Too good for the spin! Oh yes, now what we got here? We have our cornbread being cut up. Mama, I mean, Mama is, this, is this the baby of babies? Is this it? Is this oh, that's the one. 
So if you're going juicy. Look how juicy they juicy, are. Juicy. Juicy, loosey, goosey. <laughs> oh, yummy, yes. Yummy, yummy, yum. Yummy for my tum tum. Okay. So we're getting ready. Here we go. These are, this is our chicken prepped and ready. We got chocolate cake. So we're coming at you. This is the hotel. This is where I'm doing my event. The Arlington Hotel. This is the Indigo Restaurant. So I just thought I'd give you a little idea of what the place looks like. And then we will do another shot to show you when it fills up. There's my table. That's it. Beautiful. We're going to bring some soul to this place tonight. Yeah. Okay. Wings. Yeah. What else goes on there? And then we got the. You got your sweet potato salad. Coleslaw. Coleslaw. And we're not doing that with the mine, no? Um, no, they. Can... Actually, no, keep hold back the coleslaw with the mains because yeah, yeah. because we've got the salad now. We've got the green salad. So let's go. Let's <clears throat> let's head it on out. We are now getting ready to plate it up. Alrighty, so here we go. Lovely jubbly. Right, Look at here. Look at here. Look at here. That looks good. I'm happy with that. Okay, our starters have come back and now we're ready to go with, you gonna put them on, with our mains. And we have macaroni and cheese, some jambalaya, succotash, co coleslaw, and that's another jambalaya. And then we have perfect. Yep. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, our ribs, our so we got Cajun chicken, cornbread, and ribs. Okay. All right, oops, careful. There we go. Can I just pop that one there for you? That's without the seat. Okay. Uh huh. That's your macaroni and cheese. That's your succotash, which is sweet corn and broad beans. Coleslaw. These are our ribs, cornbread, and this is our Cajun chicken. And that's the jambalaya with the seafood for you to share. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. So in the bow now. Wanna do it, do it, do it. Oh, yeah. 